Hello everyone, in this video I would like to show the Romanian language for the text-to-speech software. As I have previously said in other videos, our text-to-speech software is a bridge between the technologies from Amazon Web Services, Microsoft Azure, Google Cloud and IBM. You can register for free to try out the software and test out if the voice is actually what you're looking for. Once you're registered, it's really easy to start up to create your audios. Here we have the languages that are available. And in this case, we can search out for the Romanian language. And here on the choose your voice, you can select between the different cloud providers that are available for the coding languages. In this case, for the Romanian, we have the Amazon Web Services, the Microsoft Azure and the Google WaveNet or Google Cloud Platform Voice. So I will just show the previews and do a sm small sample of the software so that you can see how it really works. You are, of course, the profis, uh, the ones who really know the language. So please write down in the comments, what do you think? Are there good ones? Are there not really good, good ones? I do think that eventually as these technologies keep improving, they will be even more closer to be human-like. Of course, there I do think that they are still, some of them are still robotic, but especially in the case of Microsoft Azure, they are even getting closer to be even human-like, of course, with its limitations, but it's getting better. So let's start listening. Bună ziua! Puteți folosi oricare dintre vocile noastre pentru a vă sintetiza textul după cum este necesar. Adăugați efecte vocale suplimentare pentru a vă îmbunătăți și mai mult vorbirea și, de asemenea, puteți utiliza voci neuronale pentru a face vorbirea să sune ca și cum ar fi fost pronunțată de o ființă umană vie. Sperăm că vă veți bucura de serviciile noastre. Now let's compare it with a female voice from Microsoft Azure. Bună ziua! Puteți utiliza oricare dintre vocile noastre pentru a vă sintetiza textul după cum este necesar. Adăugați efecte vocale suplimentare pentru a vă îmbunătăți și mai mult vorbirea și, de asemenea, puteți utiliza voci neuronale pentru a face vorbirea să sune ca și cum ar fi fost pronunțată de o ființă umană vie. Sperăm că vă veți bucura de serviciile noastre. Now let's listen a male voice. Bună ziua! Puteți utiliza oricare dintre vocile noastre pentru a vă sintetiza textul după cum este necesar. Adăugați efecte vocale suplimentare pentru a vă îmbunătăți și mai mult vorbirea și, de asemenea, puteți utiliza voci neuronale pentru a face vorbirea să sune ca și cum ar fi fost pronunțată de o ființă umană vie. Sperăm că vă veți bucura de serviciile noastre. And a... Google Cloud Voice, the female one. Bună ziua! Puteți utiliza oricare dintre vocile noastre pentru a vă sintetiza textul după cum este necesar. Adăugați efecte vocale suplimentare pentru a vă îmbunătăți și mai mult vorbirea și, de asemenea, puteți utiliza voci neuronale pentru a face vorbirea să sune ca și cum ar fi fost pronunțată de o ființă umană vie. Sperăm că vă veți bucura de serviciile noastre. So what do you think? Uh, personally, even though not knowing really the language, the Microsoft Azure, I find it the best one. Please write on the comments. Do you think yes? Or even though also the Microsoft Azure voice is not even the, they still have to be improved. And to show, of course, I'm probably using the English language to show the how it really works. Here we will have other types of voices. There are even children's voice that can be tested out. And once you have selected your language, you can create new projects so that the audios that you will be creating, they are saved in a certain folders. For example, here in video, all the audios will be saved. This is more for organizational purposes. And as well, we will have here the controls to do the changes that we might want. For example, here in speaking style, in the say as, this is more according to the numbers, the volume, the speed, the pitch. In case of the pitch, I do recommend to use the extremes. Otherwise here with the median or even the low and high, the changes are not noticeable at all. And if you want to add time in between, you can set up the seconds. 
So I will just write a text. And once we are fine with a text that we have written, in order and also recommendation to optimize is to really check and to proofread before synthesizing. Otherwise it will also consume the characters. Also it's recommended to use the synthesize directly instead of the listen because it will also use some of the characters and by having the synthesize it will be also ready to be downloaded. So we click and we will have down here the audio ready to be listened. Hi, I am Carlos. I live in Mexico. This is a text-to-speech software. And if we are fine with the result, we can just click here and download the audio. And as simple as that, this is the text-to-speech software. It can be used for YouTube, for Instagram, for TikTok, and for any other social media platform. And also there's some use cases are even for answering machines that are using for business purposes to have the automated answer. There are plenty of uses that this can have. Please write down the comments. What do you think? I will leave down in the description the link so that you can test out and register for free. If you have some questions, don't hesitate to write. Thanks for watching.